Okay, we're live. Hi, guys at home. Welcome in. Okay, so what are our requests today? Other than jump board. I can't do jump board today. Arms. Okay. Anything else? Abs. Glutes. Okay. Okay, good. What was it? Okay. Arms, abs, glutes. So let's just start normal work. Toes apart, heels together, squeeze the heels. Inhale, take it up. Use your abs and bring it back down. Watch your knees so they don't pop. So when you press up, they're supported. Bob, I don't think you've ever been on this machine over here. No. Hi. Good. Toes are on the bar. Okay, just adjust them as you need to. Toes go together, arms, huh, arms, toes together, knees together, ankles together. Arms are reaching. Inhale, take it up. Good. You can bring it right back down. Everybody have a good weekend? Nah. Yeah, mine was busy. I watched, went down with Gavin and watched the um, river races, though. That was fun. Man, they were knocking each other, like pushing each other around. The paddles, whoop, your kayak's going the other way. It was good. Heels go on. Keep your pelvis neutral. Tighten your glutes and lift your pelvis up without curling. I only want it up like two inches. Inhale, take it up, drive into those glutes, exhale, make it solid, don't have any wobble to it. Good, inner thighs, eight of these. Inhale on the way up, filling that spine with air, exhale, pull it back down. If you didn't hear the good news, I got the house. Woohoo! So I'm moving like June 3rd, 4th, somewhere in there. It's my head spinning. <laughs> Toes go on. Heels are high. You can let your pelvis come back down. Good. Inhale, take it up. And on the way, lift the heel. Beautiful. Use your core. Support those knees by those quads and glutes. Lift those heels as you come down. Lift those heels higher and higher. Good. Ankles together. <laughs> there we go. Nice. It's like, what's that? Yeah. Just wrap them together. Take it all the way up. Our favorite, the ladder. Hold here. Open your hips. Good. Drop for one. Press up. Hold. Bend the knees. Bring it in. Heels are high. Good. Take it back up. Drop for two. Don't let your knees turn in. Use those glutes. And bring it in. Heels high. All the way high. Take it back up. Drop for three. Good. Two. One. As you come down, lift those heels. Make those feet work. No lazy feet. Good. Take it back up and four. All the way down. All the way down. All the way up. Good. Bring it all the way in. Heels are high. Do it again. So five. Use your breath. Squeeze those glutes so you feel like calves, hamstrings, and glutes. For the schedule for June, if you want something different, leave me a sticky note. Because um, I'm working on it this afternoon. And then maybe Trish can get to it the next couple of days. <laughs> I was trying to do it this weekend and it was not happening. After eight, heels will go all the way out wide. When you're on those heels, I want you to be in your glutes. So let's lift the pelvis up, 
two inches off, but don't curl. Lift flat up so you're in the glutes, press out, and pull back in. Good. From there, we're going to go toes on, heels releve, pelvis is down. So heels lifted up. Good pressure on the big toe metatarsals. Press out and pull back in. Let's add on to this. Press out, drop the heels under. Come up, releve as you come back in. Nice. Really working those feet. Drop under, lift up. Lift those heels all the way up. Keep the pressure towards that big toe metatarsal. Hands reaching, scapulas down. Lift those heels higher and higher. How's it feel? Oh, it's like because I can always make it a little harder. Heels will go after eight. Shoulder width apart. So heels on, shoulder width apart. Squeeze in the knees. It's always important to do this one to open up the sacroiliac. Inhale, take it up. Exhale, use your abs and squeeze and bring it back down. Watch those knees, Donna. Don't let them pop. Nice. Make them supported for everybody. Nice. Take off one red spring from where you're at. Bring it. <laughs> you need a sleeve that you can tuck it into. You cut your you cut your finger again? Would you like a would you like a band-aid? Okay. So heels go on. Foam rollers. Um, hip distance apart. When you got the heels on, hip distance apart, press all the way out and hold. Okay. Yeah, I can just grab one of those. Now, lift your left foot to the ceiling and point your toe. Good. Cross it by bending your knee like a number four across the right leg. Make sure your ankle's not sickling. And bring it in. Let it stretch. Trish, just be careful. Good. And take it back out and pull back and stretch. Does everybody feel the stretch? You mean to bump their bar up a notch? No? Trish, you feel it? <clears throat> Okay. You're not feeling anything? Okay. You know, lift that bar up. There you go. <laughs> it's easier to push out than cross. Point the toe to the ceiling. Let's do eight on each side. Cross. Bring it in. Push that knee out. Don't let your hips get cattywampus. Get some pressure on it. You feel it now? Okay. Nope. Just out and in. That's just stay, yeah, to get the leg there. We want to point and bring it up. Tailbone heavy. Did you just one red? No. Um, red, one red off from where you were. Hey, number four stretch. She's going to help you today. Didn't it feel lovely? Just like peeling the weekend off? Okay. So now one red. We'll do Sarah's favorite abs. So we'll get rid of our half roller. Just, now it's just one red. And then Donnie can drop that foot bar. At any point we're doing this, you need to rest your neck, rest your neck, and shake it. No. Laying down with that one red spring. 
Your right hand is going to grab your right strap. Your left hand will go over your right hand. Good. Scoot down a little bit from the shoulder rest. Legs in a true tabletop, which means your glutes are smiling. Good. And from here, draw your hands down past your right hip and push your legs out into the hundred. Good. And bend back in as you go. Arms up. Let it, ch let it chatter. Good. Head up and press to the right hip. Press out, squeeze the glutes, and bring it back in slowly. Eight of these. Just one side. Otherwise, you'll like decapitate your head with a strap. Go up slowly, because I want to see you chattering. Good. Lift those arms up slow. Keep the hinge. Chatter, chatter, chatter. Keep your hinge the whole time. Tighten that pelvic floor. Shoulders down into the body. Did you get eight in, Donna? After eight, legs go straight to the ceiling, turn, zip, and wrap. Reach between the legs and take your fingernails and touch the bar. And then come up slowly. Now let's try to stay up on our hinge as the arms come up, make everything chatter. Good. So legs straight up to the ceiling. They come apart, but they don't lean down. Reach, touch all the way to the bar. Reach, reach, reach. Feet come back together. Point your toes, squeeze your inner thigh, straight legs. Good, reach. Make that, that hinge work. Exhale as you come up. Inhale, down, chatter. Is everybody finding the chatter? Did you, were you going slow to get the chatter? Okay. Nice, switch hands. So left hand will go on the strap first. Right hand is over on the top. Good. Legs in tabletop. Smile your glutes. Reach down past the left hip. Reach those legs out into the hundred. Reach good and slowly go up, bending your knees back in. Good. And then reach past. Good. And then slowly up. Chatter, 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 chatter. Can you find the chatter? Never stay up higher. Don't go down. Don't let your head go down. Anything there? Can you feel your abs? Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. So the more you get into that core and the slower you move, the more chatter you get. When you press out those legs at the hunter, squeeze the glutes, drop those legs, drop them, drop them, drop them. Oh, yeah. How we doing? Okay. Good. Legs go straight to the ceiling. So they are a straight leg the whole time. Don't drop them from that sagittal plane. You're just going to open them. Touch your fingernails to the bar. Keeping the head up. Bring the arms up and chatter. Squeeze the inner thighs. Eight of these. Hinge higher. I want to see you touch that bar with your fingernails. It would freak me out if you guys could do it. Where's Nita when we need her? Keep that hinge. Make everything work. Ooh, yeah. Good. Take that strap and place it on your left foot. Scoot again away from your shoulder wrist in case you scoot it up. One foot in. No, you just keep the same strap. Okay. So same strap, same leg. Okay. Okay, from there, legs and tabletop, good, hinge up, look at your navel, squeeze your glutes, we're going to do half a hundred here, press the legs out, but don't let your hips be pulled, hinge up again, good, and tap, inhale for five, and exhale, two, three, four, five, and in, hinge higher, and exhale, two, three, four, twenty, in, two, four, five, and exhale, squeeze the glutes, 30, in, two, three, four, five, and exhale. 40, in, two, three, four, five, and exhale. Now we're going to hold on 50. Lower the legs down eight inches. Lift up to parallel. 
pa- go all the way parallel. Ooh, yeah. And draw back down. Don't let your hips move. Fight for it. Good. Six of these. Squeeze those inner thighs. Don't let those hips rock at all. More core. Hinge up a little higher if you can. Who asked for abs? I feel good. Hello. Happy Monday morning. Good. Bring it in. Rest your head and switch. Bend the knees in the tabletop. Smile those glutes. Squeeze your inner thighs as tight as you can. Hinge up. Hinge up even higher. Squeeze the glutes even more. Press the legs out. Big arms. Here we go. Inhale. And exhale. Two, three, four. And in. Two, three, four, five. And exhale. Two, three, four. Twenty. In. Two, four, five. And exhale. Look at your abs. 30, in, two, three, four, five, and exhale, hinge even higher, in, two, four, five, and exhale, and hold, drop the legs down, lift them up to parallel, don't let the hips wobble at all, hinge up, keep those heels together, the windows between your feet, in that turn, zip, and wrap, keep them equal, that shape between your feet, the windows, keep them equal, hinge up even higher, squeeze those glutes, I wonder how many times they bump the camera over there wrestling. Bonk, bonk. Okay, long boxes go on for a form of swan. We're going to do a preloaded red. Just take your red and preload it. So there's straps you can just throw in the pit. Grabbing the bull by the horns. So take your small straps, have them both on the right side of your body. You're going to hold that flag like you're a matador. Grab the bull by the horns, go up and straps, lay down. Where your pecs or breasts are just off the box. Can you get up? Let's do them. Come down first. Here, let me do this. There you go. Give you a love kit. Okay, so your breasts are off the front of the box. <laughs> Buddha, Naomi, stop it. There's such dogs. <laughs> okay, so I want you to tuck tail. Your feet are wide. Breasts are off the top of the box. Good. Hands behind the head. Push out and away for three. Bend back in. Good. Keep those arms up. Press. Good. After three, keep them straight and lift up as if someone was lifting you up by your hands, but lengthen your neck. uh, Long neck, no sprinkles. Good. Come back and bend the elbows behind the back of your head like you're shaving the back of your head. Tuck your tail, so hollow out your navel. Good. And from here, reach up, keeping that tail tucked, lift up. Long, long necks. Reach up, up, up. Nice, bring it back down, shave the back of your head, hollow your abs, keep the elbows up, shoulders down, so you're still in a bit of a lift, but not a full extension. Keep that tail tucked, long neck. Out on the third one, lift up, hold her gym, lengthen that neck, there. Come back down, how about one more? What's wrong? Um, so hands go out to the side, behind the head. Good, yeah, you just got to lift up, hands up higher. I can't with that shoulder. Okay, so just, and then you can also just do it without the straps too, so you can let the straps go. Okay, if you can get on your knees, I'll have you on the child's pose, Trish, I'm not going to have you go child's pose. And just... Can you do it there? OK. 
Okay. Good, switching to one blue spring. We are gonna go teasers facing the back of the machine. One blue. One blue. And then headrest goes down and flat. Grab your long straps if you have them. If not, you can use your only straps. So for you guys who are not having any back issues, you can push the legs out and away and completely go into Cheez-Its. <laughs> okay? Or just all the way down. Um, go long if you have them. So if you have long, go long. If you don't, then, then use the only straps you have. Scoot to the front of the box. The headrest is flat. Good legs and tabletop. Roll all the way down one vertebrae at a time. Snow angel in your arms. Good. Arms come up to the ears. Pause. Do not let your biceps come off your ears. Slowly peel up. Peel up, peel up. Toes apart, heels together. Nice. If you have a strong lower abs, you can drop your legs away as you snow angel. Roll that lower back. Heels drop down into your pit. But straight legs, Sarah. Yeah. And then come back up. Lower back down and peel up. Good, biceps by the ears, pause. Good, hands go forward. You can either bend your knees in or your legs can go out and away, straight leg. Allow the straight legs to drop into the or bend, it's fine. Biceps go up by the ears, come back up. Give me some attitude. Toes apart, heels together. Good, and again. So if your legs are going down into the pit, don't let your knees bend. Keep them straight. Point your toes. Just as if you were doing teaser on the mat. Let the, let the legs go away. But you don't have to. You can also bend them in. So you can go teaser all the way down, but don't bend your knees. Okay. Thank you, Sarah. <laughs> Good. Toes apart, heels together. We're going to do eight if you're wondering what the number is. Remember, always honor your body. So try to go head all the way down, too, and come all the way up. <laughs> Turn, zip, and wrap. Shoulders down, lower back, lower back. Good. So right there, Sarah, before you come up, lower back has got to go down. Tuck tail, tuck tail, tuck tail. Then, yes, beautiful. Good. You guys point those toes. <laughs> okay. Okay. It's a good focus. It's a very good focus. Shoulders down. Toes apart. How we doing, Bob? How we doing, Cindy? Yeah. You got to really work that lower back. And I don't mind if it extends a little bit at the bottom, but the second the chin comes up, lower back down, and then roll through it. That makes sense? Were you going legs straight out? Yeah. Yeah, it's, you're having a hard time tucking that pelvis. So if the pelvis is tucked, look how long that line is here. It's a long line. So you're probably bending the knees in. So it's just kind of adding something. You know, we've been doing these for a while. It's good to add those legs out, and you can even bring it down and without hitting the bar, drop your head. But then lower back comes down. It's, it's, a, lot, it's a lot in the lower back. So um, right there, choke up to your small straps, your only straps. Good. And hands go out to the side. Ooh, I think we're going to have to add something now. Press back. Anything there? We probably need to add a spring. Okay. So I'll come by and add a red. So now we have one red, one blue. Do, do, do. Oh, perfect. Inhale. Exhale, press back, squeeze your inner thighs, drop your shoulders, and control forward. Squeeze your inner thighs. How much taller can you get your spine? Good, scapula still down. Watch your ears so they're equal. Okay, I have to tell you now, do eight of these. I love Heather. Oh, I know, she's weak. 
Can you just duplicate her? Yes. Duplicate her. Oh, yes. I was like, I have to remember to tell Jen. I have to remember. Oh, well, how refreshing. Yeah. There's a new employee at the buck stops here, and she's just precious. Go arms straight out to the side. Shoulders are down. Don't let your ribs flare. And control forward. Exhale, press back. And then control forward. Good. Smiling. Squeeze those knees. Squeeze your sit bones. Remember, I'm pulling that spine right up out of those hips. When we get back there, don't let your rib cage pop. So ground them. There you go. Yes. Eight of these. Nice. Good. Grow taller and taller. Good. Grab your tape. So up above where your loops are, that joint where the ropes come back to each other. And I want you to C curve back, legs and tail up. And you're not quite all the way down for the 100. I kind of want you in a, a bit of a teaser here. Good. Tuck tail if you feel your lower back at all. Bicep curls without your body moving. Now, if you cannot do it, slide down on your straps. 12 of these. Squeeze your inner thighs. Smile those glutes. Hollow those abs. Boy, I see some biceps. Exhale as you curl in. Inhale big. Watch those wrists, Trish. Don't let them bend, funky. Just keep them. Oh, who was requesting abs and arms? It wasn't you? Oh, yeah. Nice. Long straps go on the post. Short box. Because Cindy's here, we're doing tree. <laughs> Everyone's starting to love it, right? Okay, take your gear bar out according to your length of legs. It looks beautiful on camera. Yes. Okay. Same springs. So we have one red, one blue. Um, basically, it's any two springs to hold the carriage still. Take both feet. We'll start with both feet in the strap. And let's just do some flat backs. Arms come up. Shoulders are down. Lift kit up off the box. Scooting all the way back so your strap is taut. Keeping your glutes off the box. Lean back. Don't let your glutes touch the box. Hold here for five. Make everything shake. Four. Three. Push through your left ear. Two. One, and come up nice and tall. Good. And again, squeeze, lean back. Hold for five. Breathing four. Breath assist sides and back. Three, two, one, and come up nice and tall. Bob, it looks like someone's been beating up on you. Yeah, I know. Inhale here. Lean back. Whoa. Hold back for five, four, three, two, one. One, come up nice and tall. Don't let your glutes touch that box. Lean back. Hold back. Five, four, three, two, one. Come up nice and tall. Twist towards the front door. Good. Tight pair of jeans on. Lean. Bring hip on top of hip. Reach over the crown of your head. Make everything shake. Cooking towards the front door. Set that cheek down and back to the front. Twist towards the back door. Beautiful. Lean. Squeeze your sit bones. Put that tight pair of jeans on. Good. Do hands are over your head. Come up. Face in the back and then set it down. You might have to readjust backwards. Twist towards the front. Lean. Good. Hip on top of hip. Beautiful. Keep it there, coming up facing the front door. Then a twist to the front. Scoot back. <laughs> twist. Good. Lean. Hip on top of hip. 
Make sure that as we come up, you look towards the back door if we had one and back to the front. And again, twist, lean, good. Come up looking towards the front door. Set that hip down, back to the front, scoop back. And again, twist, lean, hip on top of hip. Good, come up looking towards the back door and back to the front and come up. Oh, now it's tree. Take your right foot and hook it on the box. Right foot comes up. Okay. Okay. From there, I want you to sit as tall as you can. It is not how high the leg lifts, it's how straight your spine stays. So feel me slide a cookie sheet right behind you. Straighten that right leg for three, or four, sorry. And three, we don't wanna cut it short. Two, hold it one. Walk to your ankle and kiss your knee. Shoulders down, hips are tied together. Lean back. I'm gonna hold right there for just a second. We gotta take you back. There we go. Okay. okay. From there, point your toe towards the ceiling. Tiptoe down, lowering your body for four, lower three, lower two, lower one. Chin is the very first thing to come in. Chin in, tiptoe up that leg for four, and three, and two. One, pull your toes, press to your heel, hold, stretch, as big a stretch as you can for four, three, two, one, point the toe, tiptoe, lower, four, lower, three, lower, two, lower, one, only if you feel safe, extend, and you can reach, chin in first, good, walk up for four, three, two, one, good, flex the foot, point the toe, Walk down, four, lower, three, lower, two, lower, one. Chin comes in, walk up for four, three, two, and hold. Stretch for four. Was that four of them or was that three? That was three. Keep holding, keep stretching. Point the toe. Tiptoe down for four, lower, three, lower, two, lower, one. Extend if you feel safe. Chin comes in first, shoulders down, walk up for four, three, two, one, pull the toes back, reach the arms, good, and pulse for 12. Now, don't bounce, but crunch. 12 of these, holding that leg up, a little hip flexor work, a little ab work, hollow those abs. Good. From there, come up, same hand. So right hand to right foot. Lift your body straight up so your spine is straight up to the ceiling and twist to the left. Yes. Drop both shoulders. Body straight up. Good. Reach. Open everything up. Switch hands. Body straight up. Good. Open that chest. Nice, 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 nice. Good, go back the same arm, same leg. The left hand will grab the strap on the side of your box. Good, foot straight forward, shoulder down. Curl through the pelvis, leg goes out to the side. Take it all the way out, and if you can get back there, you can extend. Then chin comes in and curl forward. Good, three more. Out to the side. Wait till the very last minute to open the chin. Chin comes in first, good. So don't open the chin unless you're all the way back to your stopping point. So it's like you're unraveling a snail. <laughs> Good, or a cinnamon roll. Ooh, cinnamon roll, and out. Ooh. Four of these. They can make a gluten-free cinnamon roll without sugar. That would be perfect. Yeah, cross, yeah. <laughs> Crossover, lots of better though. And tailbone's back behind you. Good, switch legs. Ah, okay, sitting up as tall as you can, the spine is up. 
Do what you can, Trish, and just rest the rest out. Lengthen the leg up and bend. Stretch. Don't let the spine drop. Point those toes. <laughs> we got to make those feet work. Then from there, walk your nose to your knee. And then take that whole unit back. So now the leg is perpendicular to the ceiling. So straight up. Scissors out the heels. The biggest stretch you've ever had. Point your toe. Walk down, lowering for four. Lower three. Lower two. Lower one. You can open it up if you want. The very first thing to come in is your chin. Ribs come in. Walk up. Tiptoe, tiptoe. Leg straight up to the ceiling. Good. Hold. Pull those toes back. Shoot lasers for four. Stretching three. Two, one, point the toes, walk down, lower four, lower three, lower two, lower one. Chin comes in, beautiful chin and ribs in. Tiptoe up that leg, pointing that toe, point, 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 all the way up. Make it beautiful, shoulders down and handsome, right, Bob? I said make it beautiful and make it handsome. Good. Walk down for four. Lower three. Lower two. Lower one. Extend if you want. Chin in. Don't grab your leg. Tiptoe. Up it for four. Three, two, one. Pull the toes down. Press to the heel. Hold for four. Stretching three. Straight leg if you can. Two. One. Last time. Point. Walk down for four. Lower three. Lower two. Lower one. Woo, chin in, walk up for four, three, two, one, pull and stretch for four, three, two, one. Reach your hands into the hundred. Curl, hollow, and pulse. Not really a pulse, it's a crunch for 12. Get that leg as up as high as you can. Oh yeah, lots of hip flexor. Shoulders down, don't tighten the jaw. Same arm, same leg. Body perpendicular to the ceiling. Good, shoulders down, body straight up, straight up, straight up. Hold that stretch, huge attitude. And switch. And the shoulders are down. Good, okay. Pull that body up even taller, we see flat spines. Oh yeah, switch again. Right hand grabs the candle on the box. Hips are tied together. Leg goes out to the side. Curl through your pelvis first. Cinnamon rolls. Good, chin comes in first. Coming up using your abs, not your leg to pull you up. Leg goes out to the side. Curl, curl the pelvis. Chin comes in, we got two more. Shoulders down, attitude. And out. And curl back in. One more. Isn't this great? <laughs> That's the word we were looking for, right? Great. Cross over, number four, stretch. Flat back, lean forward. Okay, we're gonna work on those glutes now. So let's bring the gear bar in. Okay, and I'm gonna show you a Bob's box, how I want your box. We're gonna do kick and goes. So you guys take your box and have it against the front leg at a diagonal. And then let's just go one preloaded green. There you go. I can get it for you right here. <laughs> so take, divide your carriage in half. Your leg goes here, right against it. Pinky metatarsal goes right on the edge. I want you to get low and press back, squeeze both glutes, and then bring it back in. Dish your pinky toe, metatarsal on the shoulder rest. Keep your knees straight on. And then go this one right against the wood. Good. Or preloaded green. It's about the same. Feel that? Yeah. Push it out. Watch if I change it to a preloaded green. 
It should be j just about the same. About the same? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Pause back there. Get those glutes. How was it? Okay. Did you get 12? Push all the way back. All the way back. All the way back. Get that glute. All the way back. Back, back. Good. Your back doesn't tuck tail just slightly. Yeah. Okay. Now, 12. Bring your hands down to the bar. Good. Bend that supporting knee. Back as flat to the ground as you can. Press back, pause, squeeze the glute. Control by bending the knee in. Make sure that this knee is behind that arch. So now booty back. There you go. Bob, better on your back on this one? Yeah. Shoulders down. Pause. Did I say happy Monday? Happy Monday. Cindy, did you see my grommets and gremlins? I posted it this morning. <laughs> oh, they're on the loose. To the other side. <laughs> what was it? Oh, <laughs> usually it's glitter. Okay, push that box in. Cut your carriage in half. That's where I want your right shin. Pinky toe metatarsal only on the headrest. Don't get the whole foot there because it sits you at a bad cue angle. Get low, booty back. Make sure your knee is behind the arch of your foot. Press all the way back, pause, and control back in. Mm -hmm. Go blue. Yeah. Yeah. And put that one right against the wood and hold on the whole time. Get there. You know my theory on glutes, can never have enough. Bob, that right shin can be right against the wood. It'll give you more stability. 12 of these, remember to breathe. I like to inhale on the in, exhale on the way out. Arms come down. Try to get that body parallel to the ground. Your right knee is bent. Where's the time go? Shoulders down. Donna, that left one a little bit more. There you go. <laughs> Down into the body. Pause out there. Get that glute. Step up onto the carriage. When you're done, we're going to do long stretch or shooting like an arrow. That one. The next one, hands go to the bar. So step up. Um, feet... Toes are close to the notch of where your headrest is. Ankles together, you're on your toes. Feet together, ankles together. Bring the body down like you're gonna do a push-up. Good, tuck your tail to protect those lower backs. Abs are on like crazy. Squeeze your inner thighs. Press out and away. Try to find a chatter. Slowly bring it over the bar. Do not let your hips drop or lift. Keep them neutral and push back out. Little arms here, some shoulders. When you come forward, get your navel over the bar and challenge those shoulders. <laughs> shoulders down, long necks, 10 of these. 
inner thighs as much as you can together. Long, long spine. Put airspace between each vertebrae. Bring that navel all the way over and smile. Wah! Yes. One blue spring only. We're going to switch it from shoulders to abs. It'll still be shoulders, though. Bring it up slowly, knowing that it's going to be slick as ice. One blue spring. This movement will be a lot sm smaller. Same exact movement, but tiny. Because I want you to chatter the whole time. Inner thighs tight. Ten of these. If you're not feeling those abs, let me know. I'll take your spring off. Long necks. Good. Keep that lower back long. Inner thighs. Is anyone not feeling this? <laughs> Hollow here. There you go. Don't let that neck sink. Shoulders down into the body. Nice. Okay. I want um, you to put, put the green spring back on. Hands will go all the way wide on the bar and feet go wide against the shoulder rest. I'm just going to throw this in here. Why not, right? Why not? It can be regular, just a green. Feet are wide. Yeah, just green. Good. Good. Come up as if you're going to do a push up. Feet against the shoulder rest, unless you're a little like Trish. You don't have to be against the shoulder rest. Good. Keep the head tall and long. 12 push ups. Angle those elbows behind the bars. Don't let that head drop. No push ups with that head. Keep it up. Keep it up. Keep it up. Good. Push ups, Bob. Let's see it. Push ups. Push. So <laughs> touch your chest to the bar. There we go. All the way down, 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 down. Up, 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 up. Good. Picking on you because you're a guy. There you go. Good. All the way down, all the way up. Don't drop that neck. Did we get there? 12 of them? Okay. Nice. Stretching. Do you want stretching and straps or do you want... Uh, so seems like it's straps. So two red springs laying down, feet and straps. I oh, know. Two reds. Two reds. A headrest in middle. Hamstring stretch. Does anyone not feel worked? Did we get it? Okay. The only thing I want for glutes was um, pulling foot and strap, but I didn't get to it. Sorry. I got them. Hamstring stretch, just hanging out. Tailbone is heavy. Hands reaching, chest open. Feel me standing on your armpits. Bring your headrest up in the middle, just so you're connected in the abs. For now. Okay, without your hips rocking, forward or back or side to side, the biggest hip circles you can possibly do. So way out, lubricate those hips. Down and around three of these. Nice. Good. Point those toes. Don't let your hips rock. So it's not a leg circle. It is a hip opener. Only three. And then reverse it, but no medial. Just reverse the circle. Good. From there, let's um, go inner thigh stretch, legs out to the side. 
Good. And take your hands to inside. Arch your back a little bit more like you have a tennis ball underneath your back belt loop. Good Z stretch, bring it down into home first. Make sure those hips are straight. Good, drop your right foot to the floor, tuck your tail and hold that stretch. Good morning, Nancy. Feel someone walking from your knee to your hip. Press down in the home, make sure those hips are nice and straight, and switch. Tuck tail. I want to see the lower back down, like I'm squishing your belly button all the way down to the mat. Feel someone walking from that knee up towards the hip, bouncing on a little bit. <sighs> you have to read my grommets and gremlins and... Let me know what you think. <laughs> nice. Drop your head as flat. Press the legs out. I want you just to flow through three short spines with the intention of stretching your spine, your lower back, your thoracic, your hamstrings. And just flow with it. Wrists are flat. Good. So, go, Bob, go ahead and take it up and flow through it. Point those toes. Wrists are flat. Opening those shoulders. Open that spine. Open those hamstrings. Nice, you guys. So remember, if you want something different for June, um, write it out for me and put your name on it. Because <laughs> I once in a while I get a sticky note without a name. And I can't remember who gave it to me. Nice shake, Sarah. After three, we'll come up in the standing. Towards the front door. Phew. How do you guys feel? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That'd be nice. Roll the shoulders back for three. Roll them back for two, letting everything go, all the stress. Roll them back for one. <laughs> They're all coming to you, Cindy. Shake everything out. One small jump. One big jump. You guys are done. Thank you. So go headrest in middle, all springs on. Your dirty straps will be on top so I can spray them down. I need your half roller on top. When you wipe down the machine, get your box and your pit. Um, anything you might have thought about, touched or looked at, just spray it down. I'll come behind you and then spray it down with MMS. Bye, guys at home. Thank you.